I'm gonna brag here a little. Parallel parking is one of my greatest skills. I can scan a space, flip the car into reverse, then with the spin of the wheel and a tap of the gas and brake, bam, I'm in. And I do all of this with just a little help from the car's backup camera and those bumper radar thingies that beep a little too much for my taste. Now, even with a tech-challenged mature car, a parking space you can enter with an old car sensor. Here's Ali Ward to explain. Most automobiles built more than 10 years ago aren't equipped with some of our favorite modern technologies. So what if you want both, your older car and newer tech? Andy Caruza has an answer to that question. It's called FenSense, a smart license plate holder that syncs with your smartphone to provide a backup camera and a parking sensor. What FenSense is and what it does for somebody is practically makes new car technology affordable and easy to, to install in any vehicle. I met Andy on a sunny Seattle day to find out how it works and to take the new tech for a little spin. Where did the thought process for this begin? I did some research and figured out there's a bunch of people like me that want backup cameras, but they don't want to pay a bunch of money for it, and they don't want to spend a bunch of time running wires. All you need to do is install a specialized license plate holder and then let the technology do the rest. Right now, the license plate holders come in two different models. One is the parking sensor model, and the technology will notify you both acoustically and with a visual display if there's an object in your vehicle's path. The other is the backing camera model, which will show you a live video feed and grid lines. Soon, those two will be combined into one new model that will perform both features in one. What kind of hardware and software do you need to run this? All it requires is the phone in your pocket to see in front or behind your car. And then does it come with the license plate that has the backup camera, the parking sensor, and then what about this button here? Use this patented tap quick launch button to auto launch the app on the phone. When you do this, the, the app will pop up automatically without you having to touch your phone. For the backup camera, we had to incorporate Wi-Fi technology because I could process a lot higher bandwidth of uh, data coming across. Andy's car was in a nearby parking lot, so we used it to test the camera model. Let's see how this is done. All right. So how do you make sure that no one comes along and steals your awesome gadget off your car? Well, it comes with these handy anti-theft screws, um, which it requires a special toolkit. So the camera is right here. Uh huh. And then we have the solar panel charging right there. So as you drive around, the, the sun will charge it for you. So that's it? Just that's one, it? two, yeah. done? One, two, and done. All right, I want to see this working. Is that cool? Yeah, let's go. Nice. You can hit the tap quick launch button. Okay. It'll pull up the app automatically, and then you get your backup camera view. Hey! Let's try backing up with it and see where we go. Oh, that's great. The, it's so crisp. Yeah. Oh my gosh, look at that. So what I'm learning is that in order to make a really cool product, yeah you have to have a lot of drive. Yep. And a little bit of hindsight, maybe? Yep, a little bit of hindsight. <laughs> Good call. <laughs>